Hey, 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 everybody. It's your boy TT back in another video. Yes, I know we're doing. We're hopping right on into this. Rebuilding the Atlanta Hawks. Okay, this one. Oh, hold on. I can't even do anything yet. I'm out here already trying to just trade people. Okay, hold on. Uh, so we have the 24th overall pick. And if you guys don't know what I did, I just simulated one season because start today's so unfortunately still broken in this game. So this is where we're sitting at with the Atlanta Hawks. And I'm going to look at Team Intel, but there is... A very good player that I am interested in. Lonzo would be interesting. Yeah, I like Lonzo. We're gonna, we're gonna put him on the list. We're gonna put him, <laughs> we're just put him on the list. Hey, if it happens, it happens. So this went all the way around, and I didn't really see much outside of Lonzo. Like there was some stuff, but was, mm, mm, I don't know. So I'm, just, I'm not seeing a ton out here on the trade market. So I am gonna go have to go build my own trade. This is the type of deal I really would mess with, though. I really would mess with this. And I'm going to make Marcus Smart a shooting guard to put next to Trey. And then we're going to flip Gordon Hayward. Okay, so this is the framework I have. It would be this. I don't need to get scared of one person. That's that's not a problem. Uh, Well, it might be a problem. Hold on. <laughs> Wait, does two ways count? No, I'm about to say, yeah. Hell no. I really don't want to get rid of Jalen Johnson just for this. But I think we might have. Ooh, he's so valuable, though. Literally one million too much. Hold on. What if we could turn this into a three-team deal somehow? Okay, because the Hornets are still good with this. We have a first. Yeah, I know. That's not enough. I'll give you my 2024 and then seconds. Hopefully. Possibly. Three firsts for Lonzo. But now I'm looking at it. Do you? I mean, yeah, you still could use both because he can come off the bench. I'm just... Would Jalen Johnson make that up value-wise? Hold on. We might have to have a sacrifice. <laughs> okay, yeah. We might have to have a sacrifice, guys. I don't want to see Jalen go. But for the betterment of the team. Oh, we're still here. So even with Jalen, we're not getting there. What about the second? So right now, I'm trying to land Marcus Smart without giving up a first. So we did. We have four seconds, I believe that was. One, two, three, four. Yep. I can count. So we're going to go from here. And honestly, I like the foundation of this team. I might blow up this 4-5 combo next season if it's not really doing well. But I, honestly, I think we're, we're, we're kind of lit. I'm going to make Herder small 4-2 in this situation. And I'm cool with DeLon Wright. I want to bring him back. And I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry it had to be done. I'm sorry it had to be you, Nate. But it had to be you. You are no longer employed at this <laughs> franchise. Trey in a 7 seconds or less system would just be absurd. Like, I just I know it would be. So we're going to try to bring him in. We do. We land both. That's perfect. This guy looks interesting. A 6'9". He kind of looks like he plays like uh, John Collins, actually. Or Kurt Simmons. Sims. <laughs> Kurt Sims. That's it. I'm not sure. I'm going to just take best available. I'm not really thinking we need anything specific. Oh, they have some guy. Okay. Well, yeah. So James Hart is here. Ruiz. And... Okay, so that guy that they had us getting is not here anymore. A 19-year-old center, but we already got Big O. So I'm like, we don't really need another young center. This is kind of cool. A power forward that can stretch the floor at 7 feet tall. Get a couple blocks. Hold on. Impossible to block is... Oh, okay. I mean, we don't need him to run the offense, so we don't care about that. Yeah, we're, we're, we're going to go ahead and draft the boy Kyle Stevens. Welcome to the team. 7-footer out of North Carolina, so we're going to keep him. In the South, he's a 77 overall. He might get rotational minutes for us next year. What's his shot tendency? 62, that's not bad. Uh, Knox, I do want to bring back. Shondi, I don't mind if we bring him back, but I'm not going out of my way to bring him back, if that makes sense. So we need a backup point guard, and that's it, really. And then third stringers. So I know they waved Kevin Porter Jr. We're not touching that. It's bad juju because <laughs> they're not waving him, so no. I will do a two-year team option. We'll give them a little bit more money to incentivize the team option, right? We'll give you a little bit more if you agree to just let us not guarantee your second year. And we just brought in DeLon Wright. Or not brought in, brought him back. We, we could bring Lou Will back, right? Yeah, we, 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 I mean, locker room, pre oh, snap. Locker room presence, that's not bad. Locker room presence, all the guys know him, they like him. We won't keep him around. Can I not afford him? I'm about to say, what? He wants $12 million. <laughs> Kevin Knox is a crazy man. Um, We're not going to take that. We're going to give him his restricted free agent, though. We're going to give him his qualifying offer. We'll let him take that. So he'll be back, but just not in this capacity. TJ McConnell would be so nice, but him and Marcus Smart in the same rotation, it's just eh. Can either of them really shoot? We're, we're going to go with it. 
player option on your second year. So we already have rim protection. We kind of need a scoring big man. That would make a lot of sense. Kevin Knox accepts his qualifying offer. Thank you. Trey Young jumps up. John Collins jumps up. Big O jumps up. Marcus Smart goes up a little bit. Herder. Bogdanovich drops slightly. This isn't bad. Okay, yeah, Lou Williams fell off, but he's 35. We expected that. And even, yeah, he's 34. He's a third-string center. We don't care if he falls off like that. Okay. Yeah, we're looking good for next season. And you guys know what we do. No matter what, make your free throws. <laughs> That's what you got to do. You got to focus on your free throws. Okay, so this is our, our rotation going into the season. I might break this up depending on how our shooting looks. Because it's really Trey Young and then yeah, some so-so some shooters. But we have tons of shooters off the bench. So we can easily put Herder or Bogdanovich in there if it's not working. So I'm not concerned about it. We'll just play it by ear and see what happens. But we're going to start simming. We ain't got no time to waste. We lost our first four games of the season. So I put Kevin Herder in the starting lineup. And we did not lose until that heat game. So I guess I was right about that spacing. <laughs> All right, so we're sitting at 36 and 18 here at the deadline, and I'm not seeing any real moves to make. I stopped for a second. We got Bogdanovich here. This is the last year of his deal, right? Oh, here's the player option. He's going to take that, mo not most likely. He will take that. So I'm not concerned about re-signing him because he will 100% be here next year. Uh, let me check on the rookie. No, not, not this one. This one. Been doing okay, it looks like. Been doing okay. 30%. We're going to give Jalen Johnson some burn. Look at that bench, though. Literally everyone's hot except for him. <laughs> yeah, wait, where's he? Here he is. He's literally 11. We're going to give him some burn instead. But the whole rotation's cooking. So, hey, we're not, you know, not going to mess this up. Anyways, we pull up here. We sitting at 53 and 29. Luka is your MVP. Simmons is your sixth man of the year. Okay. Willie Green, so we were one game behind. The, oh, no, that's the first seed out there. So we might be first seeded over here. Uh, Trey better got some love. He was hooping. Okay, he got second team. Trey was putting up 30 and 8 on 50, 40, 90. Just crazy splits. Let's go look at the whole team real quick. So, yeah, we just said Trey. John Collins had 16 and 8. Did not have the best of years. He started off really cold, though, so I'm I'm not that upset. 14 and 14 with two blocks for the big man inside. We love it. 10 points per game for Bogdanovich. His shooting kind of dropped off, but he came off the bench, so I'm not that concerned about it. Herder was our starting small four for the year. Average 10, the best he's shot from three in a while, so W for me. And here's Marcus Smart. His assists per game went up. His steals went up. He shot about the same. I mean, well, I'm not that upset. I mean, he played more minutes, so I mean, that's fair, I guess. DeAndre Hunter had a DeAndre Hunter season, it appears. Not bad at all. Big O, he was really solid off the bench. DeLon Wright was hooping for a long time. Looks great. We ended up pulling Kyle Stevens out. Not bad at all, though. And then Jalen Johnson actually ended up putting up similar. We might just put him back in. Yeah, we might end up putting Kyle Stevens back in. I don't know. And these guys didn't, did not get any crack, unfortunately. So we are the second seed. We're going to get to Philadelphia in the first round. And, and this sim, they just won the championship last year. So it's kind of crazy to see them as a seventh seed now. Do I need adjustments for the first round? Like, come on. Like, I don't, right? I don't need them for the first round, do I? Yeah, we're, no, we're not doing this twice. No. Nope. So we're going to go ahead and adjust. <laughs> we're going to go ahead and adjust now. So we're going to give you a couple more. You're good, I think. Yeah, you you didn't have a good game, but it's okay. We need a couple more minutes for you. We'll get you up. We'll get John Collins up and then Clint up. Get our get our starting unit some more minutes out here. In game two, we hold on. We we blow it in the end. Okay. It's, it's time to be concerned. <laughs> so we're down 2-0. Are we really going to be a, a regular season team? Oh, that's gross. So we're down 3-0. Well, the reason I sent that game is because what do we do? You're doing good. I mean, you're, you're doing bad, but who do we... Kevin Knox, or we're going to put our season's fate on Kevin Knox's hands. Bogdanovich isn't doing good. Clint. John Collins is doing okay. Kevin Herter said, like, our team's choking. Everyone's choking. Except for Trey. So, this is the Trey show? Okay. I don't even know what to do. Like, there's nothing you can even do. Because 
my replacements for my my starters are playing bad. So if my replacements are playing bad, then who who do you replace the replacements with? I got my third stringers, but like we're gonna go put thirty eight year old Lou Williams in here to to play a playoff game. We for real got swept. These guys did not show up. Okay, yeah, we're, we're blowing this up. We're blowing this up right here. One one of them are not gonna be an Atlanta Hawk next year because no, we're not doing this. Oh, so now the Timberwolves can win a championship. That's very interesting. I think the game's rigged. I think it's rigged against certain people. But anyway, 27. I forgot we were good. I keep forgetting that. We're moving John Collins. I feel like he's more valuable out on the trade market, and he played worse. Getting Jaron Jackson Jr. out of that would be absurd, actually. Ben Simmons. I, I could talk myself into Ben Simmons. Kale Bridges. We can get Dame. They're, they're just giving away Dame out here, huh? We're not doing Dame. <laughs> Uh, Mikael Bridges is interesting too, but eh. okay, yeah, no, I don't want to trade him right now. I don't want to trade uh Marcus Smart. We might do Jaron. Like the more I'm, the more I'm looking at this, and I'm saying Jaron Jackson Jr. and I'm, I'm, I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it more. And I was like, he struggled from three, but John Collins shot one percent better. <laughs> so I mean, yeah. So they're just desperately trying to make me take a big man. Bring in Shane Rice. You wanna know why? Cause we don't want Shane Rice. He's a 76, though. We're under the options. Bogdanovich accepted. Um, He had an okay season with us. We're, we're going to bring him back. We're going to bring him back. Worst case scenario, we trade him. Kevin Knox, we're not going to offer. And then Hunter, we will offer. Perfect. We need to go revisit the market. Because now, instead of Smart, we have Bogdanovich in here, too. So we're going to go look at the market again, and we're going to see what's up. Now look at the type of deal we can get. I didn't want to give up Smart, so I sat and I waited. That makes a lot of sense. Yeah, and the Jaron Jackson Jr. trade isn't even up here anymore, so we're, we're going to pull the trigger on this deal. We're going to exchange John Collins, DeLon Wright for Ben Simmons and a first. We're going to get extra playmaking, a lot of defense, and he still can he can rebound and he can playmake, and that's what we need is the extra defense, and he can score a little bit too. But I'm going to go try to get a scoring backup point guard now that we have this done, and obviously we're going to go make him power forward. Yeah, okay, I'm vibing with this. Ooh, Sharik. We might have our point guard. So Hunter wants a $12 million a year deal. I'm cool with that. We'll give him player option on his last year. That's not bad money at all. All we need is... Okay, I'm, I'm seeing it now. I'm starting to see where we're at. Okay, so we're bringing in Seth Curry for a good reason. So what I'm looking at is, what is Bogdanovich's purpose here? This is to be a secondary score playmaker who can shoot. But we have a secondary playmaker, two of them. And we have somebody else that can shoot. I think we're going to move him right here. Monte Morris. So this is the pick I just got from the Nets. Josh Richardson's kind of eh, though. Hold on. Like, I, I wouldn't mind taking him, but it's like, is there somebody else I can get? Not really in that price range. So, yeah, we're going to take this. We get a new backup point guard, and then we're going to get Josh Richardson, who I'm probably going to make in a shooting guard, for being honest. But I don't know. Yeah, we're going to bring in Bryn Forbes, actually. In case Seth Curry falls off, we have another shooter. So Trey Young just keeps on growing. Ben Simmons is growing, even though we changed his position. Big O jumped. Kevin is getting better. Whoa, all of our guys are getting better, really, except for our vets. So yeah, Seth did fall off just a little bit. Free throw camp. Okay, so now we're in the season. We are going to wave Bryn Forbes. In our head, right, we gave him like a non-guaranteed training camp deal, right? That's how we're doing it. But we're going to go ahead and sign Sharif. He's too good to not have him on the team. I'm just trying to see. Ooh, he falls off a cliff. Yeah, yeah, we can't get away with it. Okay, so going into year two of the rebuild, we got Trey Young, Marcus Smart, Kevin Herter, Ben Simmons, Clint Capella, and then we got DeAndre Hunter, Big O, Monte Morris, Jalen Johnson, and Seth Curry at the end of our rotation. But we still do have a secret weapon if stuff gets ugly. All right, so we have to see how that goes. All right, so we're sitting here a week before the deadline at 33 and 19. And you guys can see we kind of just, besides this little stretch right here, we've kind of been winning games more. And it's because we just switched out Jalen Johnson, who was struggling. I don't know how Kyle's even doing. Kyle's doing better, and that's what's important. <laughs> Kyle's doing better, and Seth is doing what we brought him in to do. What just sucks is we just need a better power for it. And I'm not sure how to get there. Because I don't, I mean, yeah, we might have to trade Jalen. Ooh, we might have, I don't want to trade Jalen, though. Okay, so we just won four straight games. Well, no, five, but four since we just talked. <laughs> so 37 and 19 now. I'm, I don't know. Because Monte Morris is on the last year of his deal. So flipping him would make a ton of sense. 
But $10 million is not bad for what he does, and he's playing great. Scoring, playmaking, not turning the ball over, and he's shooting efficiently. Like, you can't ask much more out of a backup point guard. And he's, I mean, he's not good defensively. He's okay, but, I mean, hey, that's why we have smart here. Because, yeah, it's not even my guards aren't my problem. I need to figure this out. I mean, he's not playing awful. We're going we're gonna to ride the season out with Kyle. If he doesn't do good, we'll trade for or we'll, we'll figure it out in the offseason. But I think Kyle can help us get there. Okay, so we're slightly worse here. 50, I mean, 49 and 33. Not great considering everything, but it could definitely be worse. And Trey did make second team again. 33 and 9. He's doing the best he can. But it's just not enough. Why are we going against Philly again? Yeah, but you know, I, I, I want my get back. Yeah, you're right. We, we're here for this. We are here for this. Smart shot awful from the field. Okay, Herder, your job here is to hit, hit that three ball how you do in the regular season. If you choke, Again, you're finding a new home. You understand? We don't have any more second chance here. Yeah, move players. Um, yeah, give you a couple more minutes. So you're only getting 12 minutes a night. My bad. <laughs> my, my bad, bro. I didn't, I didn't know that if we're being honest with each other. They change up anything, really? Okay, they got Kelly Oubre over there. That's fine. Harden's uh, still getting worse. So we got to an early lead. Yeah, we remember last year. We remember. Ooh, we blew it, though. Holy Oh my gosh, I can't even talk trash for y'all because y'all blow leads. What is happening? Is this like an Atlanta curse? Okay, come on. We win in this one though. I can talk. Look at that fourth quarter. We went to OT. We went to the fourth quarter up 12 and went into overtime. Ben Simmons is carrying us though. Okay. You're, you're still shooting. Okay. Kevin. Kevin. Mm, Kevin. And why are you shooting? Why are you shooting 17 shots if you're not making them? What are we doing here? Oh, man. Smart might have to get benched. Oh, even Seth Curry's choking right now. So this is not good. I think there's a curse on our city. You can't even blame us. Like, literally, like, if he shot 40% for... <laughs> Look at this. His entire career, he shot 40% from three. And then it's just now he can't shoot anymore. Like, it's literally a curse. No way. No way. You so you haven't even made a three. I see why you're playing 12 minutes a game. I see why. You freaking suck. That's why. Richardson, man, we ain't got nothing to lose. What's up, bro? Oh, Smart's playing like garbage. Start Seth. Yeah, we're not playing Seth for 30 minutes, though. Let's do that. We'll, we'll split y'all minutes. You'll play 25 still, but you're coming off the bench now. We'll start some. This is some awful defense back here in this back. <laughs> some awful. Oh, Harden's being guarded by Trey. That might be why. Yeah, no, we, we we still lost. Okay, so you know, you know, even Simmons was trying to. He was just like somebody got hit these things. I hope. Hey, and he didn't even play bad. He was actually good. Hey, we should play them more. And look, look at this. Look, look, look at this. Kevin Hurd has played his last game in a Hawks uniform. We're shipping out people every year. I'm, I, we're, we're I'm over it. We're done. We're done here. <laughs> so Herder's finding a new home. DeAndre Hunt, like we're we're gonna shake some stuff up. We are shaking some stuff up here. Cat, what is this? What what is their team? They have Sexton, some guy. Oh, they brought back Dennis Rodman. No wonder they're w winning games. And Ricky Rubio. I literally said last. I said it. You guys, if you watched last video, and if you haven't, you need to go watch that right now, and then come back to this one. But I said my goal is to bring in Ricky Rubio, and I I knew I should have done it. If I would have brought in Ricky Rubio, we would have won a championship. Okay, in a tangent, I'm done. <laughs> I knew we would have won a championship, though. We were right there. Draft lottery. Hawks. We have the 23rd. You guys are getting out of here. Yeah, you're gone. You are gone. Something I just thought about, though. Hold on. Hold on. Yeah, he can be our four. That's good. So we're not even going to trade Hunter. And Herder doesn't have any real trades. So, yeah, we're not moving him right now. We're making a move. I'm pretty sure we're going to go do that deal back there. Yeah, we're going to go do this deal right here. We're changing our 23rd pick, and we're going to bring in Malcolm Brogdon. I'm liking this idea. I think I love Smart's defense. I love his playmaking, but dog, <laughs> we cannot get, we cannot live with you shooting 39 percent from the field in our full regular season, playing 30 minutes a night. Like we can't do that. Unfortunate, but it had to be done. Cause we have an MVP candidate in Trey here, and we're just not putting stuff together. He wants 25 million dollars. Yeah. So Morris is first priority player option on your last year, your deal. And I want someone who could kind of d up. Beverly would make sense, but he's he's like 98 years old. Grayson Allen, interesting, but I don't know about that. Yeah, definitely on the minimum, bring back Richardson. That is one thing. We're not going to give him an offer. We're not going to give him an offer. We're going to sim. We're going to watch this and make sure no one else tosses him one. 
but we're not going to pay him $25 million. And I think next year is going to be our last year, so we need to win a chip now, or at least a finals run, okay? That's, that's what we're really depending on is a finals run. We need that. I need a defensive guard, and I don't know how to get there. Teams are starting to offer him some stuff. <laughs> I'm not vibing with this. I'm letting you know. I'm not having a good time anymore. Sharif and Big O both take theirs. Okay. Free throw camp. And I'm going to do some more combo guard for Trey. Look at those numbers. They're already 99s. I kind of fumbled this. That's on me. I'm cool with it, though. Go, so going into our might be last season. I don't know. Because the problem is we have him who wants $20 million. And we still have Capella here. So we need to choose between one of them if we do continue. So that's kind of rough. And I'm like, Ur, I don't know. So, yeah, we got Trey, we got Brogdon, we got Herter, we got Simmons. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I told him it was his last year. <laughs> he, he he lived somehow, okay? I don't know. Simmons, we got Capella, Big O, Heald, Morris, Jalen Johnson at small forward, which is going to be an experiment. Otherwise, we got Josh Richardson in the wings who's ready to come out. So, we're going to we're gonna see real quick. Come on, let's see. We get one win. And then we get a blowout loss. And then we get a win. How's Jalen Johnson looking so far? He's not bad. Yeah, uh, DeAndre Hunter's still not. Buddy Hill's not looking good. That's, that's something new. I mean, this is very early in season, y'all. So it's like I'm not judging them like that. Come on, y'all. We're gonna we're gonna get this. We're gonna figure this out right now. Hold on. Send him there. And I don't want him. <gasps> the Pacers and Pistons disagreed. I tossed way too much for that. Holy, Jalen Johnson, Seth Sharif, two first and a second. And I got DiVincenzo and Porter. That was a lot. That was definitely a lot. I'm not even going to pretend. Okay, but hear me out. <laughs> hear me out. They saved me, almost almost saved me last time. They can come help me one more time. Because he was struggling. And uh, our power for Jalen Johnson was struggling. Okay, we're good. Uh, now let's see. Let's see some something. Look at this win streak. We're on. Come on. I'm just a hey, GM of the year. Put off a midseason trade to save the whole season. Hey, I'm just. We still have not lost. Are, are, you, are we witnessing this at the same time together? Where I, I created the best team in NBA history with one trade. See, I'm I'm big brain like that. Come on. Who who else done this? Oh, okay, we lost it off. <laughs> Who else made an in-season trade and then went and won, like, what's that, 16 games or something crazy in a row? We just, I'm just like that. We're right before the deadline. Poor Junior's not doing that good. DiVincenzo turned up. We're good. I don't, I don't want to change anything. No. Ooh, and Big O hit a three. We're, we're going to live with this. We're going to send this season, and we're going to live with whatever result we get from this year. Because we had the talent. We're good now. Yeah, this is a huge year because we got Capella going to free agency, Simmons, Big O, Brogdon. I mean, not you. Even Chinzo. Yeah, like this This is the year. This This is the year. We're not coming back from this. So we need to win now. <laughs> At one point, we were 15 and 13. Now we go 59 and 23. Darius Garland got your MVP. Come on, Trey. That was yours. But we did have coach of the year. He didn't even make first team. He made third team, averaging 30 and 9 on the best team in the league. Ben Simmons made third team too, though. Are we being for real? We're we being for real. We had him on all defensive first, and that's it. We ain't got no time for games. Where are the 76ers at? Oh, they ain't made the playoffs. They ducking. They ducking us. It's good. It's all good. Yeah, take take out all your anger on the Knicks. Come <laughs> Is this a joke? Every single playoff run. Every, he ended up shooting 39% in the end of the year. Oh, yeah. I didn't even do that. Hold on. Hold on. Even though we lost game one, I'm so focused on trying to win this. Trey, 30 and 9. Brogdon, 16 and 7. Simmons, 17, 6 and 8. Capella, Big O, Herder. Healed. Yeah, he never played again after we got DiVincenzo, though. And then that's the full rotation. That's everybody. We need to get this together. Like, what is happening? Is it because we got Ben Simmons? We won a playoff game. Thank goodness. We won, we won a playoff game. Okay, we're one step closer. Come on, y'all. Come on. Okay, now this, this should be 2-0. Do, don't blow this. We don't blow these. This is way too much. Take that anger out. Yeah. Take that anger out. Come on. Okay. 
And we win in overtime by 13. Trey Young. Yeah. You got it like that. You got it like that. And Brogdon's starting to hoop a little bit. Yeah, okay, okay. Starting to work together. Okay. We're up 3-1. We do not blow those. Even in Atlanta, we don't blow those. No, we don't. See you later. 40 and now, ooh, 11 threes. Even Brogdon is cooking. Okay, yeah, this feels good. Okay, we're going against Milwaukee now. Who we got in Milwaukee? Oh, Harden went out here to go play with Giannis. After after what, what, what he said, he said, you know what? Maybe I was wrong about running dunk, man. <laughs> Maybe I was a little wrong about him. We win game one. Big O dominates. Ooh, the big man. They ain't got good bigs. They don't have good big men. Oh, Bobby Portis. Man, they eating him alive inside. And game two is another dominating win. Okay. Okay, come on. Yeah, we're starting to have some fun. Game two, come on. Come on. Come on. Game three. We're, we're right here. We are right here. We're about to sweep them. We need one more win. Come on, y'all. Come on. Okay, we lose one. It's 3-1. We don't blow those. All right? I, I need this up like in the, in the locker room. We don't blow these. Why is that? Because we don't blow these. That's why. Come on. Trey had a bad game, and we still won by 20. We're in the conference finals against the Celtics. Oh, man. Um, well, there's good news and there's bad news. There's bad news. Is we're playing the Celtics, who's, who's like pretty much undefeatable. However, I'm not seeing Peyton Pritchard, so maybe that's a good thing. Let's go ahead and go. Let's go, and we secure game one by one point. Tatum just cooked. Okay, we're coming up game two, and we boot, we do pull out game two. Simmons take over. He outplayed Jason Tatum. That's what we need from you. Okay, Trey, if you choke away our one chance at championship, come on, hold on to it. Hold on to it. That's 3-0. That's 3-0. It's in 31-12. That's what I thought. Yeah, this is, this is your shot. This is your shot at the championship, Trey. Come on. We made it to the finals. Okay, this is a, this is a win in my book already. This is a win. All right. We made it to the finals. After not being able to leave the first round. But now we run into this problem of Jalen Green, P. Willie. They got, they got Tingus Pingus. Oh, man. A championship would be some some icing on the cake. Oh, man. Come on. We want, we want a championship. I don't care. We want this. And we win game one. Trey. Yeah. Come on. Come on, y'all. We can do this. Come on. Yes. Okay. That's game two. That's game two. Okay. It's 2 0. Oh, ooh, Trey. 46. I want to be happy, but last time we were up 2 0, we lost in six. So, no. Ooh, okay. Ooh. Ooh, we almost came back, though. We almost came back. Okay, we're up 2 1. Come on, keep going. Keep going. 3 1. We don't blow those. We just won a championship. We just won it. Yeah, it's over. It's over. Don't even show up for the next game. It's over. Okay, we might not win this game. We, we won it, though. We won this game, though. In overtime. In overtime. Trey Young is your. Oh, man. Come on. He's your finest MVP. I already know. We did it. We brought a championship to the A. I told you, this is the last season. If I didn't make that trade midseason, we would be looking at lottery balls right now. You understand? We would be looking at what pick we have in the draft. 31 and 10, 50-50 splits for the boy Trey. You know he ain't missed no free throws either. It was it was all thanks to you, man. Brogdon was hooping. DiVincenzo, he didn't even play that great, and he was doing good. Herder, not Herder, Hunter was doing good. Herder, he finally, is it a coincidence? He shoots good, and we win a championship. It's almost like if my role players do good, yeah. If our role players do good, then we do good. It's, kind of, it's a crazy concept, ain't it? I mean, well, Morris. Almost got rid of him. He shot 45% from three. Ooh. I had them snipers. Anyway, thank you for taking time out of your day to sit here and watch me with my hoops, man. I hope you all had a great beginning of your day. And I hope you have a great rest of your day, no matter what. Either way, it's your boy TT, and I am out. Peace.